Anixis. Welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how I make this handmade dolls using some plastic bottles. So over here, I'll take this kind of bottle and some white card paper. Then I'll just stick it on top of this part, which is basically the bottle cap. Yeah, so once that is done, as you can see, this is what it looks right now. Then I'll just use my fingers and press down the upper part. Then as you can see, the bottle cap is coming out very easily. This way you can change doll's dress as many times as you want. So now I'll just make another coiling out of white card paper. Now once that is done, I'll make some long coilings as well. So these two will be for the hands and then the shorter one will be for the neck. Then as you can see I am cutting some palm designs over here just out of the card paper. And so once this is done, as you can see, this is what the tiny hands looks right now. Now I'll just fold these two coilings for the hands. And this way I'll just insert the neck. Then I'll cut these two sides over here this way. And insert these two hands which are folded. So now once these two are done, I'll be sticking the palms as well and once that is done, I'll put these card paper pieces over here and then on the neck as well. Then I'll take some tissue paper and I'll be just folding it and making the head. So I'll just fold and put some glue on top of this coiling. Now I'll just apply the second layer of the tissue paper for a smoother surface to work on. And then over here I'll make another coiling out of the tissue paper and be making it onto the head. So once that is done this is the cut paper and I'll be just cutting these two tiny parts over here. So now this will be for the nose. And I'll make the ears as well. Once that is done, I'll take some tissue paper more and just rub it and make a ball. And then stick on each of the sides for the ears. So now once that is done, I'll cut the access tube and this is how the doll's head fit. Once that is done, I'll take another piece of paper over here and put it on the shoulders just to secure it in its place. And this is what it looks right now. As you can see, once that is done, I'll put some more coilings over here as well and just give the body a perfect size and shape. Once that is done, I'll put it in the front too, the paper. Now guys, I'll put this part on the back side as well. And once that is done, as you can see, this is how my base of the doll looks right now. Now just to give it a more nice weight on the bottom side, I'll be just putting some cardboard cutouts. And then I'll start painting my doll with some acrylic paints.
Now guys, once the body painting is done, I'll be making the eyes, the nose and the lips as well. So guys once the body is painted I'll just give this part a nice white colored base. Now let's start making the dress. So for the first dress which I made in one of my previous videos what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna take this velvet fabric, black velvet fabric and then I'll just be cutting it like this making the threads and once that is done I'll be just taking it back side and tying it all the way through so that it will give you a very nice design as well and this will give you a very cool no sew and no glued effect of kind of the dress so now once that is done I'll cut the excess part of the fabric And this is how she looks. Once that is done, I'll just give this black velvet fabric again onto the bottle. And I'll just repeat the same thing, the cutting out and then the tying part. So guys once this part is done I'll take this black mesh fabric over here of course my, in my camera it's looking like a dark blue but it's not it's black in color and as you can see I'm going it and making this kind of ruffle it's just true black color then I'll take some wool over here and this is how I'll be tying this ruffle onto the tall dress. As you can see after closing this doll this is how her black dress looks right now then I'll take the sequency black fabric and make a ruffle using this wool and this way I'll just make a very cute poofy sleeves for her Once that is done, I'll use some glue over here and make some designs. And once the design of the glue is ready, I'll just sprinkle some glitter golden dust over here so that this dress looks more elegant and pretty.
Now it's time to sprinkle some glitter and make this doll look even more pretty. So guys now as you can see this is how the dress looks right now now let's make start making the hairs and it's very very easy as you all know that I make the hairs with silk thread and wool and it's so super easy because I've made so many styles and so many different ways of the hair making that you can go and check it on my channel in all my videos so this way I'll just make the hairs and then trim and give her the nice haircut so this time I'm going for a short haircut over here so I'll just be trimming it out and giving her the haircut once the haircut time is ready I'll take this card paper and just take this measurement of the head this way we'll make a cute little hat for her so once this hat is ready as you can see I'll be sticking them So now once this done, I'll just start painting the hat with some acrylic black paint. And then over here, I'll be painting this part as well with some black color so that it will give you a black gloves effect. So now once that is done, I'll just decorate the hat a little bit. Now as you can see, my one doll is ready. Now I told you, it's a three bottle magic doll. So that way I'll take two other styles of plastic bottle as well and then I'll start making the dress for these two as well so that whenever you want you can change them and change the whole complete look of the doll. So after taking this red velvet fabric over here I'll make the ruffles. Now I'll just tie this ruffle onto the plastic bottle. And then I'll take this very beautiful black velvet fabric. It's kind of navy blue, dark navy blue velvet fabric and it has some very nice sequency details on it. Then I'll just make the ruffle and stick it over here as well. Now after that is done, this doll dress is ready. Now I'll take another plastic bottle and give the weight over here as well. Just cardboard. And then I'll take this blue colored fabric. And then I'll just cut it from the middle. And then I'll start making the ruffle over here. So on each of the sides, I'll be cutting very tiny holes. And this way, I'll just start applying this black wool and making a ruffle. Okay, so now once this is done, I'll just take my bottle and put it over here. So this will be another count dress. And then I'll put some golden mesh on top of it. I'll just tie it over here. Once this is done, as you can see, this is the third dress and all of these are now completely ready. You can just take it and remove it anytime you want and make her look more beautiful by applying the other dress. So guys, this is it. This is the final video. I really hope you guys liked it. If you did, please make sure you give a big fat thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. If you hit the bell icon, it will just make me so so happy and because whenever I post a new video, you'll be notified. Till next time, bye-bye.
Do you believe me that I'm alone? Yeah.